Welcome back. It's Memorial Day weekend and many of us have plans and those plans, well, they may go to the wayside if the weather does not cooperate with us. It's the unofficial start to summer. Lots of folks like to grill, but what happens if you don't have a grill? Uh, I have a side dish that you can take. You can make it into a full on entree if you really like, uh, and it's very simple. I'm going to show you. It's kind of like an upscale pasta salad. It's a fregola with corn. But Mari, what's fregola? I'm so glad you asked. It's like a teeny tiny pasta. If you can't find pastis fregola in your, um, in your grocery store, use any small pasta. I used elbows. They were on sale. 99 cents. There it is, if you can see it. See, teeny tiny pastas. That's all you need. So, uh, the ingredients. You've got your fregola or your other tiny pasta. Butter corn, frozen. It'll make your life a lot easier. Some scallions, some vegetable stock, or chicken stock, whatever you have at home, and then some parmigiano or grana padano, and of course, salt. Dan is back. Betty is waiting by. Yes. They're very quiet. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm sorry. Um, I was letting you do your thing. Yeah, I can talk and cook at the same time. I've got the pasta going. Uh, quiz for the, for the audience. When do you add salt? to your water when you're gonna make a pasta. While it's boiling. Thank you, Betty gets one point. <laughs> Dan is eating, I don't know what he's eating. So but do you do it before you put the pasta in, just while it's boiling? You, you while, when it comes, when the water comes to a rolling boil, okay. you add your salt. You want the salt water. Salt like the sea. Briny like the sea. Yep. I have my scallions, and you're just gonna chop them up any way you go. The pasta's already done. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna get this business going. I love chopping a scallion. Why? Why do you like I chopping so, the scallion? It's, so it's satisfying. Just, just like boom, 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 it boom, is. Boom, boom, um, boom, boom. And so these, all these rest, these, these See, ingredients. My mom would say you're throwing away. I know. A lot of I have to. There. I have to tell you. I'm gonna just put this to the side and pretend I'm gonna use it for later because I'm with <laughs> I'm with your mom, Betty. I hate wasting. Right. Well, you chop this up. I, no, I know my... you cut up the bottom, but why'd you cut up the top? Uh, because I don't want these little you don't roots. The roots. No, no, I, I know that. I'm saying the other side you chopped off. Because like uh, this part is looking look, look a little scraggly. Oh, I okay, got you. Right. Okay. Look a little scraggly, so I'm getting moving it out of the way. Scraggly like me. Scraggly like, yes, like you, actually. You had a busy night last night. That's I can't I even so believe scraggly. you're still gracing us with your presence. Yeah, I'm waiting for some pasta fajoul here. It, you know what? It's, it favors a pasta <laughs> fajoul. I always use unsalted butter because that's just, I like to control the salt. So if mm. you use unsalted butter, you can easily control the salt. Yeah. This hopefully is going to start going. I heard there was pasta fajoul here today, and I said I'm going to come in. You ha uh, That's the only reason why I came in. <laughs> this is kind of like a pasta fajoul for those oh, of you at not? home. I keep saying <laughs> it's, it's not technically really a gone? pasta fajoul, but for those of us at home who don't know what a pasta fajoul is, what is it, Daniel? Oh, I have no idea. You don't know what a pasta, and you call yourself Italian? Isn't it like with some meat sauce, right? This is where I start to lose my mind. This is the I'm part. This is the time you start to lose your mind. So once the butter's going, you've got your scallions chopped. I'm going to use about half of these. Well, this is, I mean, this is like watching paint this dry. The soothing. speed of your, of your scallion you. cutting. Well, you know what? Her fingers um, are intact. My fingers are intact. You don't have to be a madman. I love being a madman. Well, I know. That's why, that's why I love the scallion cutting. Okay. You know? Well, listen, there's your butter. You're going to add your scallion. Uh -huh. I have this on a medium-ish heat. Doesn't it look pretty? Heat. Mm -hmm. By the way, I highly recommend frozen corn. It just makes your life easier. Yeah. Oh. If you want to cut it off yes. the ear, be my guest. It's not going to be me. <laughs> I'm using two types of corn. A roasted corn mm. and not just a regular sweet corn. Uh -huh. Is this so on? canned corn would be blasphemy here. It right? wouldn't be blasphemy. It would just add more water content, yeah. Yeah. That we're and then you wouldn't necessarily need so, the vegetable. So you bought that roasted? I bought it okay, roasted. Okay, gotcha. And I'm doing a mix and match. Now, where do you buy that? I got this uh, actually at Stop and Shop. Okay, gotcha. And my refrigerator. Uh -huh. So you're gonna move this up. Let's say you don't like corn. Who doesn't yeah. like corn? You know what else we could add? What? Peas. Oh, okay. oh. You get a little pea action. Is that on? It's on. It's oh. just taking its sweet time. Okay. You get all this business in here together, and it's also very pretty. It is very pretty looking. Right? You like that? It, it just kind of yells summer. It screams summer. Yeah. Uh, I'm not going to strain this into the sink, in part because we don't have a sink. Now, you save that pasta water. 
can save a little bit of pasta water. Yeah, but save yeah. it forever because that's But what do you do with it when you it, save it? When you take the pasta water and add it to whatever sauce you're making, yeah, it's mm -hmm. delicious. the uh, the starch uh -huh. kind of binds oh, everything right. together. I got yeah. it. I'm going to stop there. Look how calm she is. Yesterday, I'm I'm gonna gonna We're so of, used to a frantic Ben. I'm going to add a little bit of this. <laughs> <laughs> add a little bit of this. We don't know what to do with <laughs> ourselves right now. Add a little bit of that vegetable. You know, I'm getting a little Julia Child. Oh, well, you know what? <laughs> vibe. I, I take that as a compliment. You just got to get the bottle of wine out. If we had a bottle of wine, this would be a completely <laughs> different show. And I'm just going to put a drop of wine. So if we had time, we would let this really come together. We mm -hmm. don't have a whole lot of time. I'll listen to Byron. You Byron. Pour, for pour once, Eric. Byron is giving up his time. Yeah, because she can cook. <laughs> <laughs> he said because she can cook. Uh, so you have your pasta, you have your corn, yeah. your scallions, you've had add a little bit of salt. The cheese oh, is really part. what makes the this key, going. Right? I have parmigiano, that's reggiano. Key. Now you got it, yeah. And you're gonna. That's the, yeah, oh, yeah. So what this is kind <laughs> of, it's that's a little bit of an elevated mac and cheese, if you yeah. want to call it that. Okay. It's a little bit of a um, pasta salad, uh -huh. if you want to call it that. This could be, if you really wanted, yeah, a main dish. Yeah. But you know, we were thinking like initially we were gonna grill, and then the weather was not cooperating. So some of us might have to eat inside this weekend. Yeah, I was thinking, you know, because that's why I was asking if it was cold. I feel like this would be great as like a cold pasta salad. You could make it right? cold. You could make it, then have it come to room temperatures. You can make it the night before, put yeah. it in the refrigerator. I don't know, with the cheese, I don't know if I'd want it cold. What? Parmesan like, Parmesan really what are you talking about? No. Oh, well, yeah. Um, fellas, can I have some more salt and pepper, please? We have to sadly go, but I'm gonna plate this for you guys. Oh, oh Tyler, we can't Tyler's wait. Going it smells to the store. delicious. I'm gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna plate we don't this have for everybody. everybody. We go to the store. Yeah. We're, gonna, we're gonna try it in a little bit. Well, you keep yeah. stirring. I'm gonna here keep stirring. Oh, here it comes. Oh, well, thank pepper. you, darling. Only the finest. What did we steal this from the bodega? I mean, this is on. <laughs> Only the finest. <laughs> Look, this is what happens when you cook here. <laughs> Only the finest. We, are, we got the full uh, 99 cents. <laughs> <laughs>